Thank you for coming to pick it up. I really appreciate it. What? Well, you're not going to make me a cuppa. You've dragged me all the way up here. I've got to get through all this, haven't I? Oh, charming. Not even time for a little catch-up. Sorry. It's OK. I know you're busy. Well, maybe we can go for a coffee later. My shout. Don, why are you doing this to me? What? what all this talk about coffees and catch-ups. I mean, you said you wanted to keep it professional, remember? <sighs> Chill your boots, Jamie. I just thought you wanted a break at the calf. No need to be all serious about it. I just assumed that meant spending less time with each other out of work. I mean, one minute you tell me to back off and the next you want to spend all afternoon with me. I know. I can't help it. I can't keep chasing you, Dawn, OK? It's, it's too much. I'm sorry. It's just difficult, isn't it? What is? Hiding how I feel. Well, then tell me. How do you feel? The same way as you. I'm falling for you, Jamie. Yeah. Well, I'd better get these back. Thanks. What does she want? She's picking up some documents needed signing, that's all. She's getting on all right at work then, is she? Yeah. Yeah, not bad. And what about you? How's your morning been? Fine, just uh, busy with paperwork. Busy? Yeah. And how are you doing? Feeling better? Like you really care. What? Why did you lie to me about Millie? Telling me she wasn't feeling very well. What are you on about? I... I bumped into Angia before. She told me Millie's absolutely fine. So you're actually listening to what Andrea says then, are you? Yeah, I'd listen to her over you right now, yeah. And what's that supposed to mean? Stop lying to me, Jamie. Who's lying? I don't know what you're on about. Firstly about Millie, and now this. I just heard you both. I heard you and Dawn. I heard what? What she said about falling for you. Gabby, you're being stupid, OK? You got the wrong end of the stick. OK, yeah. That's right. Twist it round on me like I'm mad or something. I mean, what was all that about this morning? Asking me if I'm OK, trying to make out you care? Of course I care. You just can't help yourself, can you? Pretending to be nice to me, saying all those things. Oh, my God. That's what you were trying to do, weren't you? All that talk about how how difficult things are gonna be, all that talk about sacrifices, to think I was doubting having this baby. That's actually what you wanted, isn't it? You don't want me and you don't want our child. You think you can manipulate everything, don't you? What? Trying to put me off having the baby. That's not what's happening here. Look, can you just go, please? I've got calls to make. Why would you pick a skank like Dawn over me? Don't talk about her like that! You know, I thought we had something special together. You and me? Are you actually mad? You know, we were getting on. But that was just an act, wasn't it? You needed someone to show you how inconvenient having a baby is, you idiot. Inconvenient? Yeah. I thought you'd realise yourself it wasn't easy, but you're just too thick. You think it's all cute baby grows and fancy prams, but it'll ruin my life. Not as much as I will. When I tell your mum how you've been treating me. Well, just leave her out of it, will you? Why should I? She deserves to know what you're really like. Gabby? Gabby? Why didn't you answer me? You've not phoned my mum, have you? <laughs> 